of Body Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89, and today's Manga Nerdigan Live reaction video is going to be for Witch Watch Chapter 31. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit um, that like, uh, share, and subscribe button. And if you love what I'm doing and want to help um, uh, keep this channel alive and kicking, feel free to hit up my Cash Up and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So... Oh, God, I love Keiko so fucking much. I love the yin yang motif we have with him, too. I love his werewolf um, self, and I love the lore for it as well. I love that anything crescent shape will turn him into a werewolf, and I love the fact that it's not a full moon that turns him into a werewolf. It's a crescent shape. I think that's really interesting, and I wonder if, um, if it's... The same thing with how he gets killed. If it's a silver bullet type thing or if he has to be decapitated, something. I'm really curious about that now. But also, hashtag witch watch supremacy is going strong. Um, it goes to show you that originality, you know, it sells. People love originality like this. Anyway, let's get to this chapter um, and see what's in store for us uh, this week. Nico, Kanashi, and Keio are talking about romance. Yes! Oh, God. Whoa, really? So you and Morihito aren't an item at all? Nope. Totally one-sided on Nico's part. What? God, stop! Um, still, it does seem like Morihito thinks of Nico in some kind of special way. Maybe romantic feelings aren't his thing? Or is he just, like, forcing them down or something? You know, it's kind of creepy how observant you are. <laughs> Sorry, Khan, you've been replaced. Because I love Kanchi. He was my favorite character. Nah, no more. Keiko has, has taken over. And this... Oh, Kenta, I love the title of this chapter. It's The title of this chapter is Release the Romance. Yes. Dude, this has been a very... This past week has been a very shippy week. And I love it. My, my inner shipper loves it. I am not a toxic shipper like a lot of these motherfuckers. No, I am not. I love shipping. But I, no, I don't like threaten people over it, over my ships. No, it's stupid. And yeah, Morihito is a total square, right? Never, uh, never mind me. It's like he's not interested in girls, period. What, seriously? A healthy high school guy not interested in, uh, not interested? Um, and girl? Okay, translators, seriously, proofread, proofread, proofread. Interested in girls or that in general? I mean, I wrestle with lewd thoughts all day. Am I the only one? Am I just weird? Lewd is hope. Lewd is the future. Oh, God. If you don't understand, I go read Fire Force Maga. Uh, no, you're totally normal. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, yeah, uh, Western entertainment industry, lewd is normal. Deal with it. What are you talking about? Nothing much. Just wondering if, um, more Hito's interested in girls or not. Oh. <laughs> okay, God. No, really, what the heck are you going on about? So, uh, yeah, uh, what's the deal, Morihito? You interested in that stuff? Do you think girls are, like, cute and stuff? Do you maybe, you know, like any of them? Um, you're asking if I think girls are cute? Isn't it or kind of embarrassing to think of girls, uh, girls that way? What are you, a little kid? Oh, my God. No, really, do you mean that for real? It's like he's emotionally frozen in fourth grade. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a sec here. Back when we were uh, putting out YouTube videos, you totally admit that you thought Nico was cute. Nico's cuteness. Yes. He's just, he uh, just called her cute like it was no big deal. Well, she is. Uh, somehow I get the impression of um, your definition of cute is just like little animals and stuff. God, please stop. My poor heart will break to bits. Oh my God. If you really have to know, um, if you really have to know, I'd say my lack of interest is probably from my training. Training? One of the tenets of Ogre Keong is, um, being not obsessed with women. What is that dumb tenet? I hear most people generally ignore, uh, that side of the mental training, but I took it seriously. You're too serious. I 
ever since then, the idea of romantic feelings for others has seemed wrong somehow. Eesh, overdone training can um, uh, be as bad as a curse. Mm. Aha, there it is, a spell to release the heart's restraint. If I use this, I might be able to get an honest reaction out of Moy. But he has a will of steel. I'm not sure this spell will be enough. Oh god, this is not going to end well. Free release! Uh, free release! It's a spell that loosens the bonds of re uh, restraint on a person's heart. It is, however, only a temporary spell. It will not remove the bonds forever. I, I'm happy about that. It, it, uh, no, you can't... You can't do that. Remember what Genie and Aladdin said, may Robin Williams um, rest in peace, that you can, magic cannot, you know, he, that he cannot do shit with necromancy, you know, awaken the dead and all that, revive the, not awaken, I'm sorry, revive the dead, and you can't fuck with love, mm-hmm, ooh, ooh, I like this, I love seeing the romance, like, chained up like that, and snap, chains go um good morning boy morning do i look different um um no uh why would you you look exactly the same as always Ooh, boy thirsty now um oh yeah you're right um i'm sorry that sounded weird huh forget it uh, yeah, I figured it wouldn't work on someone as steel willed as moi oh nico it worked mm. Yummy. Um, pass the blueberry jam. Since when has Nico been this cute? Uh, what? You a dog now? What are you doing, uh, Morhito? We'll be late. Right, sorry. <laughs> and how come I keep glancing over at her? When I wake up, she's there. We walk to school together. Her long hair glittering in the morning sun. There's a summer festival, uh, this weekend. It'd be great if we could all go. Right, Molly? Uh, damn, I'm so stinging at me right now. Dude, this art is great. Uh, Mojito, what's wrong? Um, nothing, just go on ahead without me. See, this is what happens when you suppress your feelings for that long. It's just burst like that. This is a chapter where it basically tells you do not l suppress your feelings. Don't do suppress your emotions. Um, let's see. Um, huh? I, uh, I've got a bit of a stomachache this morning. Take her and go on ahead, okay? Okay, if you say so. Take her? What the heck has gotten into me? See, don't, su don't suppress your lewdness. Don't suppress your emotions. Girls, 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 or I should be like, girls, 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 yes! Get that Motley Crew on this morning. Oh, God, I'm gonna have Motley Crew stuck in my head today, huh? With the girls. Girls, girls, yes! And I've seen them, seen it live too. Oh my God, Motley Crue is amazing live. Um, why are there so many girls at this school? Because half of the population is female, you moron. Geez, has school always been like this? For some reason, I suddenly feel mortified. I can't get romantic thoughts out of my head. Heck, I'm even start uh, feeling those first stirrings of desire. Let me explain. Morihito's uh, romantic feelings have been kept so firmly in check that the sudden release made them balloon in size. See. This is what happens when you keep your thirst in check. You become what? Dehydrated. Don't become dehydrated like that. Um, and now I'm seeing couples everywhere I look. A girlfriend, huh? I, uh, I think I want one. Okay, so we'll go for, um, go to a movie for our da uh, date tomorrow then. Yay! Uh, now it's up, uh, off to bed. It's time to sleep. Hey, Moy, can we maybe not leave the house together tomorrow? Huh? Why? Because then it won't feel like a date. I mean, we're a couple now. This is temporary, so we should meet up there like other couples do. Um, be at the theater by 10, okay? Don't be late. I won't, I won't. Jeez, what a weirdo. Oopsie, I get on your case about not being late, but then I showed up late. I'm sorry, Moy. Ooh, I actually like this outfit. Um, do I like it tucked, the blouse tucked into the skirt? Mm. No, that's the only thing I don't like. I don't like. Why? Stop tucking in your blouses like that. Ah, Moy, is your tummy feeling better? 
Uh-huh, I'm fine. I'm too cute. Really, you don't look fine to me. Uh, really, you don't look fine to me. Just, uh, just don't come near me right now, please. Yo, Morihito. Um, yeah, good morning, Morihito. Yikes. School is too hard to handle. Uh, that day for the first time ever. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. I think things got screwed up here. Uh, hold up. Okay, no, okay, this is just what he was thinking. Okay, I got confused for a second. I thought things were out of order. Um... Uh, for that day, for the first uh, time ever, Morihito left school early. Um, ah, the men's bath is best. You're sick? I have to be, um, I have to be. My head has been weirdly stuck in the gutter lately, too. My mind has been stuck on an ever <laughs> long journey down the gutter to Tartarus for, since like 2003. <laughs> Um, all of a sudden, girls everywhere look cute to me. I, um, I even think about having a girlfriend. It's a natural. Go ahead, laugh at me. I deserve it. Well, perfectly normal for the average high school boy. It was unnaturally weird for Morihito. Oh my gosh, the spell did work. Whoa, you, whoa, what are you freaking out about? That's totally normal. You're fine. Dude, I'm happy for you. Really? Yeah, totally. I mean, you don't want to know what goes on in my mind. It's way more over the top. I have to wonder if, like, I'm the only one who's this much of a freak. Oh, so this is normal, huh? Totally normal. <laughs> um, boy, actually... Don't cast weird spells on me! I knew something had to be wrong. Me, um, me having romantic thoughts about girls I don't know? Even looking at um, idols on TV and thinking they're cute. Let alone um, seeing the nape of a girl's neck under a ponytail and feeling stuff. That just doesn't happen. Dude, that really, that's totally no- Wait, 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 wait. Is that normal to think that the nape of a neck under a, po a girl's neck under a ponytail, you feel stuff? Like, is that normal? Is that normal? I don't know. That's weird. Dude, really, that's totally normal for a guy. I don't know if that is normal. Remove the spell right now. Um, I could, but it's only temporary in the first place. It should wear off any minute now. You're right, it did. <laughs> What's with that blank look? Sheesh, Nico always has. Sheesh, Nico always has to find some new way to meddle with stuff in the most aggravating way. Hmm. Still, it felt kind of nice to let my emotions out. See, gotta let your emotions out once in a while. More ways than one, because otherwise, if you're pent up like that, oh, it, it could be very frustrating. <laughs> you do not want to be sexually frustrated, because then you end up like a, one of these Karens that take their sexual frustrations out on the world. Morning, Moy. The spell wore off, right? Morning, no, it didn't! The thirst may have calmed down, uh, the thirst may have been quenched for the most part, but Woo! we need some progress on the ship. Oh, the, um, the Moko ship is happening. We can make some progress on the Moko ship. Dude, this has been a really good week for ships. Holy crap. The Moko ship. Let's go, Moko! Hashtag Moko! We are moving. We are moving. Oh, it took forever for the Moko ship to get uh, get going, but ooh, we are making progress on that Moko ship. Yes. <sighs> At least it's moving faster than um than the uh wait than the stern ship. Oh my god, the stern ship in Sosuno no Freyren took for fucking ever. But Stern, but Stern is a moving, and now woo, we're getting somewhere with the Moko ship. Release, oh dude, I know what I'm calling this. Release the Moko. Yes, release the motherfucking Moko. We are getting our ship. <laughs> oh God. Oh, the Moko shippers are just losing it. I don't know if I'm the only person that is losing it over this Moko ship, but I am fucking losing it. Leave, let me live my life. 
<laughs> oh God. Anyway, I'm very curious what you guys think. Um, I definitely like this chapter. I do. And this isn't the only chapter where we have this, um, underlying theme of why it's bad to suppress your lewdness, suppress your, your feelings like this, romantic and lewd feelings like this. We had it in, we just had it in fire force and I'm glad we're getting chapters like this. Cause it's really important, um, to not hold back your feelings. Well, cause, well, if you suppress your feelings, romantic feelings like this for, or I'm sorry, I gotta use the lewd for this. That's the better word. If you hold back your lewd feelings and um, lewd thoughts for so long, that this is what's going to happen. But once you let it out, um, healthily let it out, of course, then one, you'll feel so much better. And then, you know, you'll find that balance. But don't listen to these motherfuckers that say it's toxic masculinity. Because that's what they're going to say. This is toxic masculinity. No, this is normal to have lewd thoughts and shit like that. Because oh, what lewd is hope. And lewd is the future. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy and Zinc. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help keep this channel alive and kicking so I can keep bringing you more. Um... Uh, which watch content. There's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, find me on PlayStation Network. That is in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nardigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.